So in an enterprise data center, there's a lot of moving parts. There's hardware components, there are software components. On the software side, you have things like applications, you have protocols, you have often a virtualization layer. On the hardware side, you have a physical box. That physical box has CPU, it has memory, it has storage. All of these boxes form a logical cluster. And within this cluster, everything's talking to each other over the network. And so why are analytics important? Well, when something goes wrong, how do you figure out what the problem is? All of these pieces and parts are interrelated. And so when there's a problem, it percolates throughout the stack. And so analytics can really help identify where a problem occurred and what are the affected entities. I've been here at Nutanix for about four months now. And in that time, I've had the opportunity to work with a lot of great folks. And I think one of the things that's interesting to me is I came from a startup that was acquired by Nutanix. And being at a smaller company, I was the sole voice of user experience and design within the company. Here at Nutanix, I've come into a situation where there's a large team in place and there are multiple people doing the same kind of things that, that I do. And for me, it's been, it's been very cool uh, because the quality of the team is very high. And also uh, from the CEO on downwards, the commitment to design, the commitment to usability, the commitment to building the best possible product from our users is quite evident. My experience joining the company and coming here and working directly with, with several folks from different departments is that everyone that I've interacted with has been quite humble. From a high level on down, you know, I see the respect and the appreciation for the employees and I see the commitment to doing big things, to doing great things, to doing interesting things. And I also see that it's a, a good place to have opportunities and to grow. The company is not content to rest on its laurels and, and just say, okay, we're a hyper-converged company, we're doing pretty well, we're just gonna, you know, we're just gonna stop here and kind of coast. That's not in the company's DNA. The company wants to do big things and I'm, you know, happy to be a part of it.